Uh, this is the tutorial on GDP and GNP. GDP is gross domestic product and is usually used to measure the growth of an economy. I'm going to be doing this by reading a couple of notes I've got because otherwise I'm going to go um, uh, and stutter all the way through it as I do most of my videos. This one I've actually got some preparation for. So GDP measures the value of output produced within the domestic boundaries of the UK, for example, or any other country, over a given time period. An important point is that our GDP includes the output of foreign-owned businesses that are located in the UK. Now, the equation for GDP, which I'll put in the description of this video, is GDP equals C plus I plus G plus X take M, which are in brackets. And when you put X take M in brackets, you get what's called net trade. Go go for each, each which each of them stands for. C is household spending. I plus e, no, I is capital investment spending. G is government spending. X is exports of goods and services, and M is imports of goods and services. So that's GDP. Is C plus I plus G plus X take M, which is in brackets. So that's GDP. And GNP isn't actually the opposite, it's basically GDP plus net property income from abroad, which is MPIA. I've got written here, in contrast, gross domestic product um, is concerned only with the factor incomes generated within the geographical boundaries of the country. So, for example, the value of the output produced by Toyota and Douche Telecom in the UK counts towards our GDP but some of the profits made by overseas companies within production plants here in the UK are sent back to their country of origin, origin adding to their GNP. Now in the UK, we have a higher GNP than GDP, which is a good point to make when, say for example, having the immigration debate. So that's basically GDP and GNP in a nutshell, which is used to measure basically the economic growth of nations and economies. So I'm going to put up more tutorials soon. I'm going to look for something to put up for, for um, the news videos, which I have a commitment to doing. Uh, and that was your year of revision tutorial on that. And I'm going to come up with uh, some more tutorials in the near future. If you have any things you want me to do tutorials on or want to hear my views on, uh, just send me a message on my inbox. Uh, feel free to comment on this. And uh, subscribe to my future videos if you want to see more of my news or tutorials. Yeah, this is your free vision. Thanks for watching this tutorial.